Hello, what's up, guys? How are you, everyone? I hope everybody is well. Today, I have Lexus, and I will show you how to diagnose this car with computer. Okay, and if the video is helpful for you, be sure subscribe my channel, like, share, and comment, please. If you need more video like this, okay. This is my computer and uh, this is OBD wire, OBD2. OBD2. And this is OBD wire in the car. You can see white color. Oh, it need to be connected. See, I connect. then you have to switch on your car okay see switch on and then you have to turn on your computer see, like this turn on diagnostic and this car is lexus so i search lexus see lexus search lexus any car if you have toyota lexus automatic selection read the win number reading need some time and this car is is 350 select is 350 your car which model and uh, which version you select like this okay 2011 it's not have a, it's don't have radar and yes see you can see voltage also see computer corner 12.1 volt diagnosis auto scan I need to see if my car any fault is there or not engine pass no fault transmission pass no fault ABS and traction pass no fault brake system no and SRS means airbag no fault communication meter no fault body control rain sensor right mirror left mirror my sliding roof passenger seat driver seat body control 5 3 master switch gateway control module everything is proper no fault air condition and then park assist monitor EMPS electronics monitoring power system uh, my power steering have fault okay I need to see which fault then you scroll down when it's hundred percent finish I need to see my power steering press see everything everything no fault I need to see EMPS okay okay read code trouble code torque sensor zero point adjustment not performed oh i need to program torque sensor that's why it's fault coming same like this you can check every car and any fault is there or not every car scanning system same like this okay